Stop the Bleeding is made possible by Shire. Cool. So we can meet up at the mall around 6.30? Whoa. Uh, let's just meet up at the mall. I got things to do after work anyway, so... Okay. Yeah. Cute. Yeah. <laughs> okay, see you later. Who was that? That's his new girlfriend. Her name is Carol. You dating someone, bro? Goose is afraid to let her know that he has hemophilia or even where he works at, because he's kind of worried about what she might think. Did somebody say lady trouble? Did your mom end up joining the gardening club? Did you take that 140 count of Blaze Doyle's back for a refund? I thought you were going to. I left them on your desk with a note. I didn't see a note. There was a note. You never leave notes. Are you accusing me of not being a note leaver now? Benny, do you feel like we fight a lot about little things? You take that back! See? Oh. So should we break up then? Yes, I think so. Okie doke. Did we just... I think we did. Okay, Goose, tell me exactly what the problem is here with you and your lady. He's got a disclosure issue, yo. I haven't told her about my hemophilia yet. Why not, man? Come on, you gotta wear your hemophilia like a badge of honor. Challenges are what make us men, also women. I just don't want her to think like I'm weak or something. Yeah, like a bubble boy that has to stay at home. Yeah. No, 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 no. Actually, when I first told my boyfriend about my hemophilia, he's pretty excited to learn more about it. But if I don't play along, they might make this about me, and I do not need that kind of crazy in my life. Here's what you gotta do. Educate her. Tell her about all the advancements in treatment and care, and how it allows you to lead a practically normal life. No. Explaining hemophilia 101 to someone is exhausting. Plus, it always leads back to the same question about paper cuts. Yo, what if I go along and then she'll be the weirdo without hemophilia? Mm. You wanna go with me on my date? Why does everyone always push me to do things with Ace? Three's a crowd. Brandon agrees with us. I'm pretty sure that Brandon agrees with me. What do you think, Brandon? Yeah. Benny, this is difficult because I love you very much, but we really shouldn't be together anymore. Yeah, it's confusing because I love you too, but I also do not think we should be together. Thank you for understanding. But where I failed you as a boyfriend, I will more than make up for it in this breakup. This breakup will be a breakup you'll never get over. Okay, we need to remember that Ace is really dope. He's very dope and he could help you on the date. Also, two hemos are way better than one. Oh boy, a whiteboard meeting? What are we brainstorming, boys? Goose here has a new girlfriend and he hasn't told her that he has hemophilia yet. Oh no, you gotta tell her right away. But what if she laughs at me? Don't let her find out. But I can't keep it a secret forever. Well then what do you suggest? I don't know. This seems like a good stopping point. I do have another meeting to get to. Can we table this for now? I need some water. Goose, you're dating someone new. Oh my God, this is so exciting. Did you meet her at one of our events? Does she have a bleeding disorder as well? Oh my God, wait, does she not have a bleeding disorder? Have you told her yet? What are you gonna tell her? That is such a scary place to be in. What if she's weirded out by your hemophilia? That would feel the worst. Oh my God, this is intense. Benny? Mm. What's with the tape? Oh, I'm marking off our sides. But what if I have to go to the bathroom? Well, you should have thought about that before we broke up. Oh. Stacy's gonna remember this breakup forever. And thank that Benny. Fine. He was a pretty amazing ex-boyfriend. <laughs>
Quick, quick, quick. Benny and I have decided to break up, and I feel that he's taken it a bit too far. I haven't even gotten to throwing all her stuff out the window and yelling at her in Italian. Quick, 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 quick. Yes, I learned how to break up for movies. Where else am I supposed to learn that from? I mean, would you get a load of this guy? I think that we can break up amicably and still be friends if we respect each other's feelings. Uh, quick, quick. And the workplace. Throughout. Quick. I haven't even seen that movie. But I'm willing to give it a try. And if it doesn't work out, at least we'll still have a hit movie on our hands. Once she really gets to know who you really are, she may want nothing to do with you, and that's her right. What Dr. Young is trying to say is that for any number of reasons, she may not be in a place where she feels ready to handle the relationship. But that shouldn't stop you from trying. I don't want to lose her. You can't lose what you never had, Goose. Goosey, that man speaks pain, but it's the truth. If she doesn't want to date someone with hemophilia, then you're just delaying the inevitable. This person probably isn't his life partner. Statistically speaking. Tell it, man. Come on, Bruce. Open your heart. Rip it open. You know what? Thanks for nothing, everyone. Hey. That was really good advice. Why are you getting angry? Just too many cooks in the kitchen. Come on, just gotta take a minute. You can do it yourself for me. Goose, your girlfriend is here. Hi, Carol. Hi, Gus. Um, sorry for surprising you here at work, but I was walking by and I just thought, you know, oh, look, I was just looking. How, how did you find out where I work? It's on the wall behind you when we face her. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. yeah that, she's really sense. smart, bro. It's a very detailed and specific sign. What's hemophilia? Make something up. Wow. Make something up. Right now. Be afraid, man. Just tell me. A friend is someone who understands your past, believes in your future, and accepts you just the way you are. What? No, it's, it's good, bro. It's a poster Stacy got me. Aww. I wanted you to have half. It's a friendship poster now. Thank you, Benny. Hemophilia is a bleeding disorder that I happen to have. Wow, um, I've never known someone with a bleeding disorder before. Oh, well, now you do. So can you still get dinner? Yeah. Okay, well maybe you can tell me more about it someplace that isn't with all your coworkers. Good idea. Like a boss. Okay. Do you know what a group of geese is called? Um, a rescue. I'm not sure. No. Yeah, I'm not, I don't know why I did that that time. Actually, can I have one with the eyes? Okay. That's really cute. Look at that. Mm. their body. It's like a little, like, we can create that. It looks like a, like that's its wing, you know? 